today's guest is uh, one of the funniest guys I know. He's a, um, you know, he's a beautiful, unique fella. Thanks, man. I appreciate that. It means a lot, bro. And I'll say that to the end of the earth. I was listening to one of your, one of your podcasts, and I was, and you were just talking about, you know, when you don't want to do something, you just go do it. Um, yeah, it's really cool, man. And thanks for uh, just the inspiration and stuff, man. Thanks for saying that, man. I uh, appreciate that. Yeah, I think it's, like, as I've gotten a little bit older, it's made me feel more comfortable to just be myself. Yeah, I feel pretty, I, I am feeling a little more comfortable. I'm definitely feeling more comfortable. This is the first time I've actually even felt kind of a little, little bit more comfortable being in here. Yeah, and then Hollywood, it's an intimidating place, you know? Oh, yeah. Dude, one of my buddies <laughs> tried to put all of his fingers in his butt one time after he did, like, an eight ball of Coke. How crazy is that? Yeah. <laughs> it's like he could go, like, very quick from fun and comfortable to extremely violent and he was dude he ended up dying actually he did some pills and drove into an embankment she's out there man yeah i can't believe brennan schaub's italian i mean i i I love him and i love bill burr i mean they're both comedians when i was young he would shit in his yard make me bury it no i swear to god dude and he um i mean he probably honestly dude i was like (laughs) He probably shit 200, 300 times, and I buried it. <laughs> Hollywood's got the darkest arts, bro. And he was deviant, man. Yeah. Um, but anyway, it was cool because he, like, I don't know, you know him better than I do. I mean, he loves you. I think so. Yeah. And he used to invite us over to uh, chill out and shit, but we didn't know he was that he was a pedophile, but... Oh, yeah? You know, he would, he got us some steaks one time, and the steak come with baked potato side item. So we had uh, sour cream on the, on the baked potatoes. And my, buddy was in, uh, and my buddy was in the kitchen, and he said, hey, I'm out of um, sour cream. Can I have some of yours? And I said, no, but you can have some of my sweet cream, you know, just making like a joke about semen. Yeah. And then big Brennan Schaub goes, can I have some? And that's when all the fucking wheels turned. Fuck, man. I'm just sitting there with a mouthful of potato like, fuck. Man, but that's a... That's crazy, dude. Yeah. Do you think Japanese people could be from space and not know that they are? I think so. Have you ever watched any of them have sex? Yeah. We used to hear a bunch of them having sex at night and you could hear... um, you can uh, go outside and even in a residential neighborhood, dude. There's 70 of them on your block. Yeah. Like, there's, yeah, I mean, that's true. I, I try to stay off of pornography, man. That's one of my biggest arch nemesis. Yeah. I see it, and I still get all the joys out of it. You know, I'm still out there e-jacking and... Oh, yeah. But I don't like that pornography. I think you could do it, dude. You know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, they have fucking bears fucking, too, on the internet. They have all that kind of shit. No. No, I don't do anything. I don't, I don't believe in bestiality or anything like that. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks so much for coming in, man. You too, man. I'll see you at the store. <laughs>